Hello and welcome back to Hexa Plays Beyond Reality. Yes, this is a return series for the first time I've probably ever done this. We are going back to the weird and wonderful world of Beyond Reality, one of my favourite wards and still to this day due to uh, past memories and experience with that ward when I played it years ago, still one of my favourite wards. So what's the deal? Why are we playing this again? Well. You may remember my original series of Beyond Reality in February last year, where I played through the 15, 17 or so maps, or whatever it was, maps 1 to 15, uh, a 17th ending map, and then a secret map, so about, about 17 maps. I played through it, I did all that, it was all done and dusted, right? Well, recently, uh, our friend Dar Psycho, or Jack101, or whatever moniker he wants to go by, the guy who made this, the story was, he was supposed to be making a Beyond Reality 2, and I did mention this in the original gameplay when I first, in the first part, I mentioned, oh, there's going to be a second one, so I'll keep my eye out for that shit, or something like that. Well, what happened was, he was supposed to make the second one, but eventually the project got cancelled, so instead, the maps that he had made for Beyond Reality 2, he just lumped them together with the original Beyond Reality in an update. So this now is Beyond Reality version 1.6. Don't worry, that's the only points and numbers we're going to be saying right now. So, when I first heard about this, someone told me, or something, somebody once told me, the world didn't roll me, relax, okay, everything's fine. But I saw it and I thought, hmm, I've done a series on it, so why not do a follow-up series or videos or... I wasn't really sure how I'd structure the videos or the series, I think I'm just going to put it... I'm going to tag it along. So this is not part one, technically, this is part... 11 was it? Yeah, there was 10 parts. So this is technically part 11 because we're still playing the same game. Uh, so we're just going to continue right on. So there's uh, about five new maps or something. So, And I think there's new enemies and stuff as well. So it's, there's been more, more stuff and updates. So, so it's a sad, it's a shame that there's no Beyond Reality 2, but it is exciting to play some new maps from what was my one of my favourite wads in the past. So I'm excited to see what kind of bizarre, surreal craziness is going to be taken on again. So I know this is completely unexpected, guys, but I hope for those of you who watched that series or enjoyed the wad or know the wad, will enjoy this. So without any further ado, uh, we have we have it as a separate episode. So the original Beyond Reality is still its own episode, maps 1 to 15 and that Forgotten Castle where you complete it and then you go to the club with all the credits and all that. We did all that. So you can still play that separately, but the, the new maps are just in a new episode called Bonus Maps. So you could just pretend it just carries on after that. Now here's, I gotta quickly say, I'm not entirely sure if this 1.6 is the newest update and will remain that way for a long time. I don't know. I don't know if there's going to be... Because fucking with my luck, I'm going to do a gameplay on these maps. And then I think I'm finished with it. And then the next day, he's going to make like two more maps. He's like, oh, 1.7, come out. I don't know, though. I should have asked him, honestly. I, I should have asked Jack myself. How you doing, Jack? You watching this? Probably not. But if he is, if you are, I hope you enjoy my showcasing of your stuff. Because, you know, I love it, so... It's what he's all about, is making the crazy stuff. So, there may be more maps to come in the future, more updates, but we're just going to go along with these maps, and uh, before we continue with the next Complex and LCA series, I'm not going to keep mentioning that in this, I'm going to keep that Complex clean, but for that I'll just say there will be a new series coming very soon, as soon as the new LCA is released, and I've got a bunch of shit to say about all that, but we're not going to talk about it in these videos, only when it actually comes out. So in the meantime, I figured I wanted to do something to, to tide you over until that. And this was the perfect opportunity because beyond reality, new maps. So yeah, let's fucking do it. Bonus maps and of course, ultra violence. Let's go. Oh, we got that music. Ooh, excited. No, I'm excited because he keeps the same theme. We've still got crazy weird stuff going on. But also, we still have the Necros, the, ch the demo scene style soundtrack that I was talking about that I love so much. So we've got even more of those in here. I don't even know what these songs are either, so I'm new to them. Oh, I'm excited. And I think there's new monsters and shit as well, and the maps have new gimmicks. Oh, I hope you got. I bet you guys aren't even half as fucking excited as I am about this, because I'm, I'm fucking hyped, okay? I like this shit. Uh, I will, there's one more thing to address though before we really get started. I'm playing this with Zandronum 3.0 and I know I've expressed my 
multitude of issues with 3.0 in the past and I've been stingy and, and stubborn and I've stuck to the 2.1.2, the older Zandronum that nobody uses anymore for certain mods, you know, but I, I gotta, not only have I gotta get with the times, but this Beyond Reality just won't open with 2.1.2, so we have to use the new Zandronum for this, otherwise the new GZ Doom, and I don't want that because I want my Michael Rosen skin. Say something, Michael. If there's one thing I love, it's a fat red plum. There you go, so he can still talk now. So this does mean when I die, uh, he's gonna drop the weapon, which is a weird bug, and I don't know why that happens in Zandronum, but when you have the death cam on and it shows the guy dying in third person, you can still see the weapon lowering. I really want people to fix that, but I don't know how, and I don't know how people are gonna fix that, but that's just the Zandronum dev team. You guys gotta fix that shit, because that shit weren't shit before, and you just shit the shit shit. So anyway, we're using that, but other than that bug thing when I die, let's just hopefully just don't die. Let's just don't die, and hopefully nobody, you won't notice anything. So let's see what we got for these maps. So you remember my, my past, I, I just sort of vaguely remember what I did uh, over a year ago now when I played through Beyond Reality, but I know the wad, so I'm expecting similar stuff. I read up in the files about this, so apparently these next three maps or so have, a, have their own little theme. What's the map called? Gravity Labs. So this is, it's playing around with gravity, which is interesting. So there's gonna be like, I don't know, moon jumping and shit? I don't know, or, or zero gravity, be flying around on their ass? I don't know. Watch out. Don't don't get hit straight away. Don't look terrible at the game. I don't know what works. You can still jump and crouch. You can still got that in here, so... I, I just don't know what to expect. That's the first thing about it, because when I did the original series, it wasn't blind. I knew the maps very well, because I played it before. But these are all new maps, so I'm completely blind to the maps. I could be wandering around not knowing what to do for ages, but I hope not. I hope the maps are nice and straightforward, and maybe if they have a puzzle element to it, then... What the fuck? Isn't that supposed to be the random demon, or, or what is that? Tiny Fatso. Okay, so that's one new enemy. Tiny Fatso. I need better weapons than this. He still he doesn't have that much health, though. Yeah, that's all right. So there are a few new monsters. That was one of them. We never had a Tiny Fatso get the shotgun quickly. Ooh, he's still got the hoo ha ha ha. Still got the laugh popping off. And he's still got the, the guy in the HUD there that kind of looks a bit uh, questionable, a bit Amish or something like that. I don't know. These guys aren't hard to take out. I think the shock did the shotgun always sound like that? Of a custom sound. I don't remember I'm sure it was just like vanilla sound. Well anyway, I got a yellow key card, that's interesting. Yeah. This is like this is looking very reminiscent of the earlier maps in the game. It doesn't look massively drastically different, but I hope the gimmick will, will carry it as something completely new. With the whole gravity labs, I'm assuming there's gonna be some play with gravity here. There's another shotgun over there, so I think we're making the right moves. Got more spectres, so there's still a lot of vanilla shit in this, so don't be expecting anything too cray cray. But what I loved about Beyond Reality was just, in general, as a vanilla wad, it's it's a bit different, it's a bit wacky, you know, it's a bit weird. Okay, I ran out again, let me grab this, more of that, but that's it, oh, memories? It's been a while since I did a series, so I just need to, I'm still a little bit rusty, I need to get comfortable. This will help, this will help before the next big series that we do. Right, let's get rid of these guys, there's a few up there. Okay, I'm liking it. I've always loved the skyboxes with the moving clouds and shit, but there's some new stuff I'm seeing here, like these red tubes of shit. I don't know what that is. Oh, I haven't seen these guys in a while. Oh, watch out. I remember them, the barrel men. Uh, barrel soldier, yeah, the barrel men were the ones that run around. What the fuck is hitting me? Oh, there's a fucking chain gun, a mutant dude up there. Hang on, save that. I need all the shits I can get. There we go. Okay, careful now. Yeah, okay, you now use pistols. So we got I don't know how much ammo they give me in these maps, so I have to be have to be kind of smart with my uh, conserving my shit. So let's just watch out. I've got how many shells I got? Five, okay. Uh, oh, this is interesting. We still got those custom textures popping off, so it's got like weird owl over there and shit like that. We still got all that going. Don't you worry. So the same old, same old, but with a few new uh, gimmicks and designs and stuff but other than that it's the same mod I knew and love I don't know if you guys know and love it but if you do then it is the same mod you know and love what is this lasers okay it doesn't hurt okay uh, nice. what, 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 what's going on Plums. is it okay it's just the same as normal okay hang on there's a few more zombies okay headless oh come right to me all right there's a berserk there okay don't want to take it just yet not until I get really fucked up let's see what we let's see what's popping in the rest of the rooms first Okay, we've got the shotgun again. More shells. I feel comfortable to use it now. 
slams and yeah, you nice. definitely have to jump. I mean, come on. I, I know I mentioned it enough times, but there's definitely a jump thing here, so I've got that on for a reason. All right, hit that. Room's gravity has been lowered. Ooh, okay. Okay, so what does that mean? The monsters drop down. What? Whoa! Okay, we got, like, moon jumping up in here now. And I notice those red things turn to green things. That must be, like, an indicator for the gravity shit. How you doing, Weird Al? What's up? You, you made any new music recently? Fun. I haven't really been following his work, so I don't really know, I'll be honest. Okay, here's some more barrel soldier dudes, yeah. I'll remember them. I wonder if all the enemies are going to make an appearance, like the, the floaty doom guy heads and shit like that. I, I kind of miss them, I can't lie. It's been a while. It's been a while. I guess one thing I could do for Beyond Reality after I do these new maps, the only other thing I could do is pistol start the maps. Because, as you remember, I saved the game. I, I still got my save, actually. Let's see. Oh, no, because I've got Xandro 3.0. Yeah, it's not going to It's not gonna show here. I was using it with the older Xandronum, so my save game is not present. But I could just make a new one. There's no problem Planned. with that. Yeah, we just jump up there. Planned. That's nice. Yeah. So, yeah, one thing I could do after Planned. I finish these maps would be on reality is pistol start the maps. Because I saved the game after every map. Uh, I could do for an extra layer of challenge, try and pistol start them, but I don't know if that's possible. I've never tried it, because I don't think the maps were intended to be. What the fuck is that? It's, it's fucking side H, the side head. I'm assuming it's a side in head. And it shoots fucking lasers. How much has it got? 180. Oh, I killed him already. <laughs> well, that was simple. Well, that was another new enemy, Cyber Demon Head, that shoots lasers out. You see what I mean? Interesting. Not that crazy. It's just another floating head type. Not not crazy crazy, but it's it's a little it's a little eccentric. Might as well take that out. Oh yeah, I remember that sound. He's kind of fascinated by the item there. I hope my commentary's on point. I hope everything's the recording and everything's all good because uh, again it's been a while since I did a series of recording and stuff. When was the last time I it was uh I can't fucking remember now. I can't forget all my shit. It's the master level shit. That was it, yeah. And then I did the live stream, and now I'm doing this. So hopefully it's not too drastically different because every time I go away for a long time and I've done shit, I'm sort of a little bit rusty and I don't really know how to jump into it. But you just gotta jump into it, you know, just, just see what happens. Okay, so there's an invisible floor here, apparently. Hang on. There we go. Okay, this is quite simple, straightforward, but it is the first map. It's a, again, it's a shame that Beyond Reality 2 never really came to fruition and it was cancelled, but at least we get to see what was made for it in the work. At least he didn't like completely cancel everything, at least he released the maps in an update. That was real nice of him. So we do get something new of it. I'm just saying the same shit I said earlier, so I'm trying to think of something else to say. Kill this bitch, die. There we go. That's, that's the substantial thing to say, right? <laughs> there we go, yeah. But this, this is the first map of the new lot, so I can't expect anything too drastically difficult. But as you remember, this world did get quite hard, so as the maps come, it might get quite, uh, quite, uh, tough. I don't know. Room's gravity been low. Okay, that's the gravity lower switch. I see some more cyber demon heads and cages over there, but I can't get in there yet. Oh god, there's some here. Okay, they're not that strong. They're just a couple of heads. You can take them. Look, they just shoot some lasers. Fucking die. There we go. I notice when he dies, he's still... It's just the head detached from the body, so when he dies, his neck's sort of, like, weirdly shaped. Face on, it looks alright, but you can still see his neck sort of cut off. Look, look, see, that's like a like a corner cut of the original Cyber Demon death animation. It's a bit odd, but, you know. What you're gonna do, it still looks kind of cool. I still gotta credit the guy for making the shits. Uh, where do I go now? Do I just go in the other room, or... There's nowhere to jump onto, no? Okay. Next room. Uh, we did that one. So what, what, I got a yellow key, I've got to remember that. Is there anything I missed up here? Red key? Oh. Yeah, okay, I got that. And it lowers this room's gravity. Okay, we're, we're killing it. We're, we're plodding along. Considering I've never played the map before, this is fairly straightforward and easy. I'm not letting these guys hit me. This is, this is, yeah. And I just let them fucking hit me. But that's okay, because it's not hard, okay? It's the gravity that's fucking me up. That's what it is. I ain't talking about the movie. Okay, I like that film. <laughs> The, the gravity is fucking me up because when you move, it's hard to like. Uh, when you're strafing, it's slower. I don't know what I'm fucking saying. Uh, I guess I go up here. Let's Blimey. see if we can go up there. Yes, we can. Okay, good. Some imps, yep. Yeah, the standard enemies. Remember them? You kill them, they don't drop a shotgun. They drop. The fucking ammo that drops out of them floats up in the air as well. Look! Whee! Oh, that's fucking exciting. That is. That's special. I like that. I'm, I'm digging this gravity uh, gimmick here. This is uh, interesting, and it certainly adds something new to the Beyond Reality set. I mean, oh, little ones. Little, little fat bastards. 
I mean, just because you don't have much size, you're still fat as shit, it doesn't count, mate. You still, for, for your, in, in ratio to your shit, I don't know what I'm fucking saying. I'm trying to say something and I'm fucking it up. Clown. Just carry on. Can I jump over there? Yes, I can. Okay, shotgunners. Oh, oh, oh. Hang on. I heard you guys. I think I've run out of shells, so I've got to just juke them like this. Just juke the shots. I'm not fucking stupid. I can do it. I think I'm stupid. <laughs> no, I can juke the shots. Don't worry. Dodge them out of the way. There we go. I've got enough bullets taken. There we go. I've also got a berserk, so don't be afraid to use that on some enemies at close quarters. Can I duck in there? No, I can't. Just checking. Kill him. There we go. Okay. And we're still with some bullets to spare. We're doing all right. Health. More bullets. What I, I heard a fireball somewhere. What was that? Oh, here, here. What is that? It's a miniature cyber demon that's coloured, cr very crudely coloured blue and is upside down on the ceiling. You see what I mean? You can't, you can't make up this shit if you tried. <laughs> nah, that, that's, that's not his most, I, I will criticise, that's not one of his most creative works. Dark Psycho's done a lot more crazy stuff than that. Need I me remember to mention, the, need I remind you to mention the, the floating shotgun sprite enemy that had shells for wings. I remember that. That was, and he also makes mod o fun. Some of you might have heard of mod o fun, where he really fucking like goes above and beyond with the craziness in that one. Like it is just so experimental and ridiculous. Is that anything goes in that one? I've got to play mod o fun. I kind of want to try it just because of how wacky it is. And you know how I like the bizarro shit. Oh, I like this. Mm. Bookcase texture in there. That's nice. A little see-through. I like that. Oh, here's where these guys were. Yeah, that's it. Okay, so I've gone in here. Alright. Switch. Door. Yeah. Ooh. Do I die if I hit that? I'm kind of worried now. Oh! <laughs> Watch out. Oh god, he's coming right up to me. Watch out, bitch. Use a bit of this. Alright. Um, so far, we've only got pistol and shotgun, so we got to conserve where we are. Remember to save the game when we pass the map as well. Okay, I'm gonna assume that kills me if I land on it, and I don't. Even if it doesn't, I don't want to take the chance. So just land on. Oh, never mind. It's an invisible floor. Okay, I'll get stuck. Watch out. Watch out for the barrel dudes. They're in fight. Okay. Die. I'm getting fucked up. Oh, they all killed each other. There we go. It made it easier for me. Okay. Blue key. Nice little switch. Okay. Yeah, it's all okay now because they all fucking die, and I'm not in trouble no more. I oh, could do with a bit more health though. There we go. Yep. That's it. Oh, more mini fat so I see that's the main appeal of showing off the new monsters for this map. I see the exit though. Alright, here we go. Yeah, this map, yeah. I didn't know whether the maps would be much shorter or longer than before. I don't know. But they seem to be about the same, if not a bit shorter, because this is the first map of the new lot, so. Okay, let's see what this new guy does. Mini side. Okay, yeah. Oh, little zoo, zoo, little lasers, like little laser sounds. I like that. Which has he got? Like, 400. So just like a revenant or caca. No, not revenant. Caca demon. Well, they got the same. I think. I, I'm forgetting shit already. Hey, there's the man right there. The man who makes the music that I love so much. Andrew Sager. There he is. I've got a super shotgun. Okay, I can use that now. Oh, watch out! He shoots really fast. I'm fucking hell. I got a quick uh, attack chance or whatever you want to call it. I don't know what it's, I don't know the technical shit, okay? Okay, we'll just take them out with this, just to make sure. There we go. Uh, I think we got some new um, some new uh, Easter egg cameo texture shit that references the stuff. I don't know who that is, and I'm sure in the comments, if you guys know, you're going to let me know in the comments, because you guys always did. And then in the next video or whatever, I'll mention it. Imps. Okay, this is fine. Uh, in, <laughs> don't know what else to say now. I'm just gonna. I'm just waiting until I get to the exit so I can say a bit of foreword about this. How do you not die to that? Come on, man. Let me through, bitch. Okay, I'm noticing something here. When I kill the imp, I can't instantly run through him as I kill him. Whereas I think in other, in the older Zandronum or other source ports, even you can you can run through them as soon as they start their death animation. But I don't know whether it's this wad or not, or it's just vanilla. But I can't seem to run past them until they're finished or halfway through dying. Okay, how do we trigger the exit then? Oh, I see stuff, there's more stuff out there. Hang on, I didn't go on the other side. There's health bonus Clown. shits. Okay, I don't, I don't remember any health anywhere else, so we'll just grab all these. Gonna need them, because remember, we saved the game in this, so we're gonna wanna make sure we're, we're topped up all good. Is there anything up here? No? Nothing here? No, that was earlier. Okay. All right, what am I missing? What am I missing, guys? Uh, there was a key somewhere. I've gotta make sure I'm on the ball here. This talk is so much, I can't remember. Okay, I can't open that. There was nothing in here but shells. There's nothing in there. Let's check the map. 
Uh, nope, there's nothing around here, so we're going to have to look around a little bit. Let's see. Oh, there's a little cave thing over there. Yeah, that's what we're missing. We need to get in there somehow. How do we fucking get in there? Hit a switch. How do we get in there? What the fuck? Oh, there's a little... Okay, it's something to do with this. No? Okay, hang on, wait a minute. Okay, that was just a switch. We've done all that. So it must be something in this room, no? Did we not... Oh, maybe we didn't finish all of this. Maybe there's something in here still? No? What the fuck? How do I get in there? Now I'm getting confused, guys. <laughs> Hang on, there's some more stuff I've missed. Okay, okay, this map might be a little bit longer than I thought. Yeah, I missed this area. There's a whole fucking area I missed, thinking I could exit already. Maybe this map is bigger than I thought. Okay, don't underestimate the map, okay? It could be better than you think. Oh, ooh, ooh. Hang on, wait a minute. Okay, get rid of the barrel, man. Watch out for the shots. There we go. I'm hearing some weird noises. What is that? I'm hearing some weird shit. Could this guy with this? There we go. Yep. Is that even hurting him? Yeah, okay. I just ask as soon as I fucking kill him with it. What is that? What is that noise? No. Okay, nothing on this shit kills. Oh, that's what it is. It's a new hazard. Okay, cool. I'm, I'm digging that. I'm digging the new new enemies, new hazards, new music, new maps, new weapons. No. As far as I can tell, there never has been any custom... There's no custom weapons in Beyond Reality, and I don't think they'd be doing any now. Maybe one new custom weapon? I can only hope. Watch out for this, because it looks it looks like it fucking hurts, so just go after it. Yeah, there we go. Like that little sound. Okay, grab the health. You'll need it. Kill both these bitches. Then flames are back. Yep, yeah, okay. Maybe I have to hit it. It's like a lift. Yeah, it's a lift. Get, quick! Get in there. Don't get too close, because it can hurt distance-wise. Oh, I see them bitches in there. Don't get the health yet, though. Because it might hurt me still. Alright, there we go. Yeah, little, little fat so again. Yep. Yeah. Just because you're small doesn't mean you're still fat and huge and weighty. That's what I meant to say earlier, I think. <laughs> okay. I'm, I'm digging. I'm, I'm liking it. I keep saying I'm digging it. I'm trying to think of something else to say. I like the areas. I like all this shit. But to be honest, in every world, I've always liked this whole play around with the floor. And when they fuck up parts of the floor like that, I've always liked that little detail. Uh, what, what did that do? What, 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 what did that lead to? I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Maybe I'll go to the opposite. Maybe there's one on the opposite side now. Yeah, I must have done everything in here, so... Oh, maybe we... Oh, now we leap onto that. Yeah, okay, no, a bit of platforming. Kind of reminds me of Jump Maze a little bit. Watch out, bitch. Shoots three at a time, I think. Watch out, bitch. Fucking... Can I hit him from there? Yes, I can. Okay, use the regular shotgun, because horizontal fire. You already know. Alright, there you go. Your Doom, Doom experts already know what I'm talking about. Oh, I thought I was an enemy for a second. That's one of those platforms again. Oh, there's some enemies. I wasted that, I know, but <laughs> relax, it shouldn't be too bad. There's a quite a whole bunch of new reference textures. I don't know, I don't know who that is. It's probably from some popular as fuck game that everyone knows and I don't. And I, my ass don't play no other games, so I don't know. Kill him one hit. Yeah, you can kill him one hit. Watch out! I'm, I fucking ate that shit. Okay, didn't, didn't kill him one hit, but okay. Is my shit even? No, it's not. Use one on him. There we go. Look, keeping the shit even for the super shotgun. See, I'm smart as shit. Okay, there's nothing back here. I'm just checking. Because you never know, there might be some secrets. Are there any secrets? Three. Okay, there's three secrets, so... I might be able to find one. Okay, what's this? Oh, I hear another... I think that's another miniature cyber, is it not? Sounds like it. It's, it's cyber demon hooves, but I don't know what one. Okay, it's the small one again. Okay, fair enough. Okay, he's not he, He's not that much of a threat. What's the point in new enemies if they're just in small tier ones? I mean, they're, they're interesting. Oh, the shot stay on the floor. Does it hurt? I don't, I don't want to know. Okay, don't go near it. Just let it explode. It just stays on the wall. I don't know how that works, but it, it does. Okay. Oh, more barrel men. Lots of them. Uh, can I get a rocket launcher? I have got one. I didn't even know I had one. I didn't fucking notice. Watch out for that. Using these shotguns the whole time. At least we have some new weaponry. Oh, I've got a chain gun. Yes, I have. I picked up all this shit and I didn't even know I fucking had it. I'm be using a shotgun. You know I love my shotguns, but I'd be using them so much I forget I've got anything else. Let's, let's mix it up a little bit and use some other guns. There we go. Okay, yeah. This map is uh, a lot lengthier than I thought it was initially, but that's just how it goes with the... Can I jump up there? Let's see. So I'm a bit experimental. Let's see if I'm getting there. Yeah, extra ammo on your asses. One clip. <laughs> but there we go. Oh, there's a bullet box right fucking there. Alright. What's in here? I see a backpack. That's going to help, because I can go back and get all the, all the ammo that I'm picky about getting before. Let's see if we can get all that shit. 
Can I just jump up? No? Okay. Let's see if I can go on the other side. Look at me. Here I go. But, there we go. I don't think I can jump to those ones, so I'm, I'm gonna leave that. I'm not gonna try and get everything. I'm being way too fucking, uh... What's the word? Too scrutinized to detail. I don't know. One of them shits. Okay, was there anything else in- Oh, yeah, doors. Okay, watch out, there might be behind me as well. No? Okay, good. See, I got- I say so much whenever something happens, because I've played this game so much, I'm so used to so much scenarios and shits, that I got way too much shit to say as I think it. When these guys open up and are saying, oh, the back, the other side might open up behind me, so watch out. Mm. It's just things like that, that, as you play lots of wads no. and that, you have to get used to those things happening. I'm saying a whole lot without saying not a lot <laughs> at the same time. Okay, switch right there. Let's do it. But, no more gravity changes? No? Okay. Is there anything there behind this? Could be a secret. No? No, no secrets. Maybe there's a secret on that texture and I have to jump on it. Look, like this. But, like this. Nice. Something stopped me on the ceiling. I don't fucking... Well, if it was, you could, you could hit it from here, so... I don't think so. Okay, so what did that do for me though? That was just led to a bunch of switches. I've got all the keys. I guess I guess I've got to go back somewhere else and see if I've opened something up. No. No. Okay. Oh, bullet box there. Gra Plans. Grab it. Plans. There we go. Yeah, that that led to nothing but switches. So we're gonna have to backtrack and figure out where the bloody hell that's led to, and what that's done for me. Let's see. Anything on the map? This is what happens when I haven't played the map before. You have to really go about it like very. Uh, Improvise. Oh yeah, this bit. This is the bit that I left out. Yeah. Okay. Oh, the head dudes. I've missed those guys. The head man. Yeah. It's been a while, man. It's been a while. Okay, I can kill them in one hit as well. I can kill everything in one hit with a super shotgun at this point. Because they're only low, low tier enemies. I guess again, it is the first map. I got to remember because it's not. It's not reading off of the the beyond reality the last maps that we did in the original game. It's just like a whole new episode. So you got to expect the first map. To be easy, relatively easy, with low tier enemies. Okay, okay there we go. Oh, Beavis and Butthead. Oh, that's a nice little. See, I recognise that. I recognise Beavis and Butthead. <laughs> of course I do. I wouldn't. I would. You would be fucking worried about me if I didn't recognise that shit. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna kill them. They're starting to fuck me up a little bit. There we go. Grab that. There we go. Chat. There's more on the other side. I tried to get two in one hit and I fucked that up. Kill this guy. There we go. Grab that. Oh, oh, I was about to pick up that health as well. There we go. Let me just check. Grab all the ammo that I can grab because remember we're gonna be saving it, so I want to grab as much as I can. Because when I pistol start, it's like, you know, I don't give a shit. It doesn't matter if I have low health. Just exit the map and then kill yourself and start again. But when I save it, which is something I rarely do, so I'm not used to doing it. But when I save it, you'll want to actually grab and collect as much as you can. All right, see if we shoot that. No, I'm gonna have to go down there. What? Oh. Oh, you just walked to it. Invisible floor. Oh, one more switch to go, eh? That's handy. I appreciate them telling me. Thanks, Jack, for doing that. It's over here. Yeah. It didn't tell me it didn't tell me when there were any more than one switch to go, though. Who's that? Some guy with coffee. <laughs> room's gravity has been lowered. Okay. Is it in this room? Yes, yeah, in this room. Oh my god. And that is from I also don't know what that is. The, these are all new textures, but I don't know what the fuck they are. Plans. Hang on, is that. What, what does that say? I can't read that because the resolution is so low. I can't read what that says, but it says alien cancer. I don't fucking know, okay? I'm going to assume that's something to do with alien or atrium? I don't know. Or HR Geiger stuff? I don't know. I don't know what it is. I don't know what anything is except beavers and butthead. At least I know that. That's the one thing I take pride in. I know that shit. Okay, let's go. Uh, I did the switches. I... Why would the gravity need to be changed in here? Oh, oh, because I need to jump on these. That's what it is. Teleport. Maybe that's the exit. Just check everything, because that might be... No, but the exit was in the other room. Okay, hang on. There might be a teleport to somewhere else then. Okay, here we go. But... Oh, I jump a little bit higher than I expect. This is reminding me of Jump Maze, though, because some of those Jump Maze maps have the high jump, where you jump higher, and it's just like this. This is basically just turn high jump on. That's what this did. Okay, why am I using this? Use the, the super shotgun, you moron. There we go. Okay, relax. I always have to keep telling myself to fucking relax though, and that ain't changed. It's been over two years since I do Hexa gameplay, pretty much two years, and I still tell myself to relax. Some things never change. There we go. Okay. I can't get him in one hit because this spread is too wide. Do that. Oh, that didn't work either. I'm fucking up. Now I need to use one. Hey, what's that here? I heard something. I don't know if that was water or the music or something else. 
Okay, this leads to where the shotgun as well. A switch again. Okay, oh, stairs made of water. That's nice. Gotta love your water stairs. Oh, that just leads back here. Hang on. I need to check that and make sure I've done everything in here. Look, there's like a bit here and shit. What, what's this? No, no, these are nowhere. And this is just like a background. Can I not crouch through it? No. No, nope, it's just for decoration. Okay. Just checking. Okay, nothing here. Nope. Okay, so this must be near the end of the map, surely. This has opened up like the exit door or something. Let's find out, shall we? Grab this health though, because you'll need it. Plums. Can I jump up? Yeah, I can jump up there. Oh god, there's some guys here! Get out of the way! Oh my god, I fucked that up. Use one, keep it even, but that's it. Now use this again. I need health again now, look. Fucking up. No. I'm trying to conserve my ammo, I end up using more than I should anyway. I don't think there's any more health around. I think I'll, I'll survive, I'll manage. I think this is the end of the map. I didn't get any of them free secrets, but whatever. Yeah, that's it, and that's how they exit. So we, we... Oh, it has a, it has an intermission screen now. Okay. Because because the original Beyond Reality just had... Um, it, it just faded out like that, and then it, bang, started you on the next map. It didn't have an intermission. So that's a new thing, I guess, intermission screen. Nice little picture. I don't know if that's a, a... That's probably a map to come with this blood form, whatever the fuck that is. We've got that to look forward to. So that was Gravity Labs, and as you can tell, I still do a fuckload of talking. <laughs> Hopefully in the next one, I'll try to talk a bit less. Already 31 minutes on my shit. Uh, the next map will probably be more the same, and considering this map was the first map and probably the easiest and shortest one, the next map will probably take the same length to fucking do, so I'm not gonna do that because the video will be fucking stupidly long and to give you a bit more a few more bites of episodes to chew through while we're waiting for the next big series that will come up I'll just keep you guys tied tidied over tied, I'll tide you guys over with some beyond reality return extra bonus map shits I don't know I'll figure that out afterwards when I title the video and shit so that was part 11 technically of the beyond reality extra with the extra shit uh, it's, it's like DLC or bonus map pack add-on or some shit. That's kind of what it's like, but it's free. So I'll see you in part 12, where we'll be taking on the duplex. See you there.